glory you will see the imagine manifesting in god's glory absolutely not in human's glory nope. you 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 can be operating in human's glory you can be operating in the glory of your past of your of your ancestors your fathers it can never be like operating absolutely. in the glory of god so absolutely. it is the season of operating in the glory in the fullness of god and we will see god manifesting himself in this year 2022 absolutely now remember that we're coming to your life we're live streaming on all our social media platforms that's on Facebook, on our Father in the Lord's page, that is at Bishop Eda Peter site, at Bishop Eda Peter site, our ministries page, it is Christ Ambassadors Church SA. Christ Ambassadors Church SA. Remember to like, share those pages, go live, share. It's a way of evangelism, you know, especially in this digital age. All you have to do, send, forward that link. Somebody needs this word of hope and inspiration in this year 2022. And remember, we also on YouTube, we live streaming on that platform too. It's at Bishop Ida Peter site. That's at Bishop Eater Peter side. Uh, um, Sister Tracy. Yes. I've been I've been coming to the Miracle Center for over four years now. About four years. About yes. four years now. Yes. And I've never the man of God has never declared the the theme of the next year in the in the previous year. Absolutely. He has never in that pre I don't know the years back. No, he's but never. in this period, that shows that there's something about this year. There is. There, there is. is something unique about this year. I, I, I don't know if somebody understands what I'm talking about. Mm. If the declaration comes before the beginning of the year, huh, that means that God was already preparing our spirit, our soul, to That's say that something from, big. You it's, understand? Something has already exploded and, in the spiritual realm. And also, realm. the man of God also declared this um, year's theme as the outpouring. And exactly. You know, there's of something. The there's something that's happening in the realms of the spirit. So we, we we believe that something about the year 2022 is just going to be amazing. It's just it going to be mind blowing. It is. That miracles will be the children's bread that we'll be we'll be sleeping dreaming of miracles we'll be we'll be Absolutely. walking seeing miracles as you, you highlight miracles mm. brother Austin mm. you know we always our father has taught us that yeah. miracles it is God's intervention in that's the affairs right. of men that's right God's intervention in that face of men mm. so don't don't cancel yourself out of a miracle you are going through whatever it is possibly you might have caused it possibly you are out of wisdom you didn't have knowledge but God it's his grace. That's you right. will intervene in your situation. Indeed. You are a candidate of Indeed. a miracle. Indeed. Like we're saying, that it's just going to be an amazing year. Absolutely. Uh, 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 the testimonies you might have heard last year oh, is for last year. Absolutely. But the one coming <laughs> forth is coming. The man of God has declared. I remember that the, 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 um, some Sundays ago we had amazing testimonies. Yes. Amazing testimonies. Some people came here with COVID. Um, some people say that I had COVID in the year 2020 and I got into 2021 with COVID. But here I am standing today. Cleared. God healed me. Exactly. And, you know, it's amazing for you to go through 365 days without being taken to the the hospital Absolutely. for you to be able to see a new year oh Absolutely. come on there needs there is something to be grateful about that you are able to see the year that the man of god declared the year of my glory Absolutely. It is something to testify about because you have stepped into the year of 2022 you are ready to overtake and take forth the blessing that the lord god has prepared for you in this season just to reiterate our father in the lord basically say that you are now in a season where you have to realize you are permitted to do the best that's true you are permitted to start that business that that's you've true. been putting aside for a long time or the one that you gave up on because of circumstances but you are permitted even to go back to school to go back for your education, you are permitted to live the super abundant life in God. One of the best ways for you to, 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 to be in line with the miracles of God, you, you need to present something to God for him to work with. Um, that is why they say for, um, um, faith without works is dead. Is dead. Yeah. So in this year of my glory, don't sit at home hoping for the best to come. Declare words. Believe it. Go out there and look for that job. It is in Absolutely. that job that the promotion, Absolutely. that God's fullness can be made manifest. Amen. So you need to wake up there, do something, because the Bible says that He will bless the works of your hand. Absolutely. So it is the works of your hand that the Lord is going to be working with in this year of glory. You will begin to experience the glory of God. You might have been working with the glory of your past parents 
with your ancestors. But, but it's this short lived. Year, yeah, you understand. It's short lived. You understand? It's only the glory of God that is mm. permanent. That's right. When God lifts you up, He yeah. keeps you there. He right. keeps you in those levels. That's right. And that is what it is. Or whatever it is, whether it's now time for you to recommit your life back into the house of God, you haven't been coming to church you have been staying out of fellowship it just doesn't work for you to say I'll connect online come back into the house of God let go of whatever it is that you feel it hurts you the God of our you know the God that we serve oh yes he is real oh yes it is we have seen God doing miracles through the men of God Bishop Edo Peter side we have seen God raise sons and daughters who are doing great all over the world who are, who are working in signs and wonders we have seen the manifestation of being a son of bishop Ida peter side so there is something about connecting when you connect genuinely when you connect with the whole of your heart to the anointing of the of the of, of the founder of this ministry you begin to see god work for you absolutely so one of the great advice i want to give to you in this year make sure that you are connecting 100 percently to the anointing that has pro if you are let's take for instance god might have elevated you to a particular level for you to be sustained in that level you still need to be connected to the source where you were blessed from. absolutely so i want to advise you this year if the man of god if god has used the man of god in one way or the other to bless you come be a blessing to the to the house of the lord be a partner partner with bishop either peter side so that he can be able to take god's God's way to another level in this mm. year that we are in. We mm. want to see the glory of the Lord manifesting in different nations all, all around the world. We want to see God's glory being manifest. We saw the glory of the Lord being manifested in Nigeria past some Fridays yes. ago when the man of God was ministering. Absolutely. That's the glory of the Lord. We want to see. We want to see the glory. This year, the man of God want to go places, but we cannot go places without the finances. So we would love you to partner with Bishop Ida Peter Side, partner with I Peter Side Ministries so that we can be able to take the glory of the Lord to every nation. Absolutely. Now remember that God is working in each and every one of our lives. If you have a test Remember that it is scriptural. It, we are implored to share our testimonies. And um, a few weeks back, you heard testimony after testimony of not just what people have received, what they have accomplished, but what, lives that have been transformed That's true. In, the, in the saving grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. So remember, you can always send through your testimony. Let us know what God has done for you. Let us know what happened on a key service when you connected to collect with the declared word of God. Now you can send them on our WhatsApp line. That's plus two seven seven nine six seven five six zero double eight. That's plus two seven seven nine six seven five six zero double eight. Or you can send an email on pastor at gmail.com. That's Pastor Eder at gmail.com. Viewers all over the world, welcome to our first Sunday service of 2022. Um, Sister Tracy, you, yes. you, you, you've been attending the Miracle Center for over the years. What are you going to be expecting in today's service? It is the first Sunday, so definitely there should be there should be a package attached to it, you know. Absolutely, when I when I from, especially from yesterday when yeah. I was getting ready and I'm be saying I'm coming into the house of the Lord this year, there is just something uniquely different. The expectation is is peculiar. It's just different. That's it's right. not the oh, the ordinary way of just doing you know things and anything like that, but. There's this expectancy that I know. There's a stirring in my spirit. And I know that God is about to do a lot of things in my life. I've encountered his hand. I've encountered his hand in my family. This past holidays, I linked up with family. But just to hear what God has been doing in their lives, I realized that most of those prayer points I'd been bringing in the Miracle Center, God honored them all. Indeed, if you, you know, we are in the, the first Sunday of 2020, 2022, 2022, yes. you have to honor God first. You need to be in his presence. Just say, thank you, Lord. Oh, thank Abba, you. Father, I'm, I'm grateful that, that I'm alive. I'm grateful that my family is alive. I'm grateful that this year, um, last year, we were not able to lose anyone. But in this year, I'm starting it with God. There is Absolutely. something about starting your year with God. Absolutely. When you start your year with God, you will see God manifesting himself all over your life. So viewers all over the world, wherever you are connecting from, just believe God. Believe God for a miracle today. Believe God for a testimony. It is our first Sunday of 2022. This is...
January, we are in the beginning of the year, and God is about to do a miracle today. Connect to collect, connect like our Father, we always say, wherever you are, distance can never and will never be a barrier to your miracle today. You know, Brother Austin, I know you work with young people. We, we've, we've, had, we've got a lot of young people watching us online, and some of them also didn't do well in the past examination period, please just encourage them and why it's important to connect, to collect, to trust God as young people. You know, one, one thing, one thing I've, I've learned over the years coming to the Miracle Center is the audacity to speak and ask from God. The Bible says that whatsoever wow. you ask in His name, you will receive. So That's when you are you're in that situation where things are not working fine, um, you have to do your part as a young person study to show thyself approved Truth, that's what yes. the bible says yes. so you have to study and when you are done studying then you begin to proclaim you begin to speak forth words yeah. because there is power in spoken words yes. so when you speak a word over your life every day of my life i speak i say yes. god this is this is your son. I've been serving you for years. You yes. can't pass me by. Yes. I am blessed beyond measure. Yes. I am a blessed man. Because you blessed Abraham. Listen, you even have the ability to say, because I am from a blessed generation. Yeah. Because my father in the Lord, Bishop Edith side is blessed. Therefore, I am a product of blessing. So in your exam room, in the, before you go to your exam, you declare it. You speak it. Have you noticed something that every time you speak negative things about your life, you see them begin to manifest? So why can't you speak positive things over Absolutely. yourself? So in this year of 2022, all I want to encourage the young people, make sure you have the ability, the audacity to declare good things over your life. And indeed, you will see it come to manifestation. Absolutely. Just as you've just heard from Brother Austin that it's important what you speak over your life, what you say about yourself. Remember to stay on your knees. Be connected to God. If you did well, we celebrate God with you. Send us those testimonies. Let us know what God has done. If you know the, 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 the varsity entrances, everything, the favor that you're receiving toward your career. If you didn't do well, he says you can go back. You know, it's a year of just connecting to the grace of God and to serve. Stay in a family, in a, in a house, in the house of God connect with other believers who can speak positively in your life in a nutshell. Now remember that we are live streaming on all our social media platforms on Facebook, on at Bishop Ida Peter site page or on the ministry website, Facebook page at Christ Ambassadors Church SA. Remember we are also on WhatsApp. You can send through your prayer requests or your praise reports, your testimonies on plus two seven seven nine six seven five six zero double eight. Indeed, you have to send in your testimony. The Bible says that we overcome by the, by the blood of the land and by the words of our testimonies. As you are beginning to see God manifest himself, today is the 2nd of January and you are beginning to see God manifesting himself. One of the greatest ways for you to shame your enemy and shame the devil is by testifying. Testify of what God has done through the Miracle Center, through ATV, like my sister has said, through Facebook. We have different platforms that a lot of people are connecting to the man of God. Absolutely. We have a lot of pl platform, And like the man of God, we always say that distance cannot be a barrier. Absolutely. If Jesus Christ can heal a child right from where, she, where he was down to where the, the child was, then distance can never be a barrier to what God will do for you in this year. You might be in, in, in America. America, in California, wherever, wherever you are watching, watching this service, distance will not be a barrier. barrier. The same anointing that is in the Miracle Center can pass through the cameras, can pass through the, 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 the platform we are, we are streaming through and can admit you. All you have to do is open up your spirit. Stir up, stir up your spirit and say, Lord, I believe if you can do it for the woman with an issue of blood. You can do it for me You too. can do it for me. Mm. Mostly God loves to be reminded of his promises. When you remind him of the things he has done, when you remind him of the promises that he has, he has kept or promises that he has made to you you said you know Ezekiah said to him when the prophet went to Ezekiah and said that you have you have few days left Absolutely. gather yourself and, and, and 
you you will be taken away yes. and the man of god say to god remember my service remember for you my service. this year is the glory of the lord yes. so you have to be in the presence of the lord you have to be in the service of the lord and there are different ways of serving god you can serve god with your time serve god with your finance there are some people that might not be able to have the time to serve god but they are able to serve god with their finances so make sure you partner with atv partner yes. with ip the side partner with b Bishop, either Peter side, so that we can be able to take God's glory, so that we can be able to come where you are right now, watching this service, watching ATV. And we believe God is definitely going to bring His glory over your life this year. Absolutely, God is going to do exploits. You know, the Bible says, Those that believe in the Lord their God shall do exploits. That's right. And in this season, in this year, you will encounter the power of God in a very unusual way. Our God is a consuming fire he is available he is real even at this moment he is real indeed the man of god has um the man of god has a lot of clips that he might have encouraging clips that you can go on facebook yes. there might be times where you are going through things and you're not able to see his face you can go to our youtube page go to our youtube page click bishop either peter side and you can find sermons that that can be a blessing to your Absolutely. life you can find um, um words of encouragement yes. on on twitter as well yes. you can go um, on twitter we have short nuggets sometimes um you know there are people that testify and say that i just came across this picture yes. and it just changed my mind mm. so you can go on twitter you can read everything that the man of god is putting there twitter is either p or Christ, or Christ uh, MC, uh, yes, it's, it's CAC, CAC Miracle C, C on yes. Twitter or either P. You just go on Twitter, you can find the tweet of the man of God there. You can find our short clips there. You can find things that can bring encouragement to your life when you are going down. Listen, there might be times whereby you want to throw in the tower. There might be times whereby you are giving hope when you hear the voice of the man of God saying Absolutely. that, no, there is still hope. There is. You, you, it, it jacks up your spirit and you begin to gear up your spirit, start your engine to be able to be able to move forward. So in this season, make sure you visit our a YouTube page, our Twitter page, and watch all the clips there at, that has been uploaded there absolutely now thank you so much for joining us and um, prepare to be ushered in the presence of god and encounter the power of god right here in the miracle center remember distance is not a barrier god bless god bless you
Excellent. Excellent. We thank God. It's the first Sunday of the year. A glorious day indeed. Let's pray for the service today. Let's commit this service today. The first service of the year. Let's commit to the Lord that God will come in a mighty way to bless us. That God will come down to us this day. Let's open up your mouth. Open up your mouth and commit this service to God. Father Lord, we come before you Lord this morning. We commit this service into your hands. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray that Father Lord, you will do great things for us Lord. Father Lord, in this service, all miracles will happen Lord. All salvation Lord will be delivered to your people Lord. And that the gospel, Lord, will be preached to your people in the name of Jesus. Father, Lord, we commit this day, or we commit this service into your hands in the name of Jesus. Ri baba ba santa li bade, re kete ke keli kata la ba santa li anda rabo sihada bada, re ba sente li anda raba sete li ba se. Oh Father Lord, take charge of this service today. Oh Father Lord, minister in your power to us this day. Oh, in the name of Jesus, Father Lord, we come before you, Lord. Re ba sente li kaya la ba santa la kate, re kete ke keli kaya la banda la bada. Re baba ba santa li mande bo sukata la bate ika yanda hari ba santa li made rika yara rabanda la bada re keteke keli kata la mande li basa li bara ba sende li bo sukai da basa re keteke keli kanda rabate li bo suta ika yanda rabata la da bade da rabada ika yata la ke keli baba ba santa oh Father in the name of Jesus Lord. We commit this service in your hands that the Holy Spirit, Lord, will minister to your people. That, Father, Lord, your will be done today. Father, Lord, we see God, our Father, before you. We pray that, Lord, you be with us and that, Lord, you will be glorified in this year, our year of glory, that you will show, Father, Lord, your power in a mighty way. That, Lord, you will be glorified and that, Father, Lord, will experience the year of glory. In the name of Jesus Christ, hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ, hallelujah. Amen. Our Father in the Lord has started this year, our year of glory. Are you ready to receive the year of glory this morning? Hallelujah. Let's open our heart today to receive the word of God. Let's open our heart to set the tone for the year ahead of us. Let's pray that God may open our hearts as we listen to his word, as we listen to the ministering today. Let God open the heart of everybody that will be listening today, that will be listening and be connecting to this uh, service today, wherever they are, everywhere, they, wherever they are, that let the Lord touch them. Let's pray now. Father Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, we open our hearts, Lord, to receive your word today that you have said, Father Lord, to your servant that to be delivered to us. In the name of Jesus Christ, Lord, we open our hearts to receive your word. In the name of Jesus, Father Lord, open every heart wherever, Father, they are, Lord, that your word, Father Lord, will come to them, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Re baba ba sende li kaye kali kayanda rabasiha ikaya talabate keli mate musata rabate li banda rabo sukata labate ida rada kali kaya rababa ba santa labo sanda labo sa oh Father Lord speak to our hearts today we pray that Lord open each and every heart today that will hear the message that Father Lord will receive Father Lord your salvation that Lord. They will receive the blessing you have set for them. That Lord, your name will be glorified this day. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 
In Jesus mighty name we pray. In Jesus mighty name we pray. Let us pray that the way that the God has sent to the servant of God today, the way that he has sent to us to say this will be our year of glory, let it manifest in our life. Today is the first service, it's the first Sunday of the year. Let us pray that let that word sink in our heart. Let that word stay with us. Let's pray that this year be indeed be a year of, of, of our glory, the year of my glory. That God may be glorified and that will enjoy this year. Open up your mouth and pray that they let this word sink in your head. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray for the Lord for the way that you have sent through a servant. That this year will be our year of glory. We pray that Lord, 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 let that word, Father Lord, stay in our heart. Let that word manifest in our hearts. Let that word manifest in our life to the glory of your name. In the name of Jesus. O oh, Father Lord, be glorified this day. Be glorified this year that Lord, you will show in your power that Father Lord, your word Father will manifest in our life. Your word will manifest in our ministry. Your word Father Lord will manifest in the lives of your children. In the name of Jesus, Father we pray that Lord, let this year be indeed the year of our glory. Let this year be a year of our glory. Let this year be the year of our glory. Father Lord, let your word, Lord, oh, let it be manifest in our life. Let it come close to our Father. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, Shandaraba Sekeriabosaha. Ikandaraba Sekeriabosata. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Finally, let's pray for the servant of God that will minister out today. That let him minister in the power of God. Let the spirit of God come upon for him, to him. To minister to us what God has said for us this year and this day. Open up your mouth and pray for the servant of God. To, for God to speak through him this day. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ... We commit your servant in your hands, Lord, this morning. That, Lord, speak through him. Oh, Father, make him a vessel of honor that will deliver the good news to our life. That will deliver your word to our children. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray for fresh anointing upon him. That, Father, Lord, he will speak through your power. That, Lord, he will speak in your power. That, Lord, he will speak in your spirit to change the lives. To deliver, Father Lord, all your message that you have sent for us this year in our year of our glory. We pray that, Father Lord, use him, Father Lord. Speak through him, Lord. Oh, deliver your people, Lord, through him, Lord. Heal the sick through him, Lord. Deliver the captive through him, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Riba baba santa la made, riba santa le mata. Rekete keli kayanda rabosa. Oh, Father Lord, speak through him this day, Father Lord. Oh, anoint him, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Come and keep celebrating Jesus with a clap of free, everybody. Turn to your neighbor, say, neighbor, this is my year of glory. If your neighbor does not believe that, look for another neighbor, say, neighbor, this is my year of glory. I will shine in the glory of the Lord. Come on, say, I will shine in the glory of the Lord. My family will shine in the glory of the Lord.
in the glory of the Lord. Come on, celebrate Jesus, everybody. You've done so much for me. I cannot say it all. Everybody say. If I had 10,000 tongues, it still wouldn't be enough. Everybody say. You're healed completely. Shukum Marobi Mo. You see candlelight. You say. Everybody say, what's it all? What's all I remember? What he has done, what he has done, so very much. What shall I render? What shall I render? To what he has done, so very much. What shall I render? What shall I render? Good! 
bonga, que a bonga, o conge se bege, que a bonga, que a bonga, o conge babesa, hey, maso pa yanta yanama. I am great and strong, grateful God for all that you have done. Oh, my God. 
Oh! 
This is the year that you have made. It's the year of your glory. Let the glory of the Lord reign in this place.
Libra Zata Yaba Sanda La Brosa He Lebra Zoto Yaba Calebra Zaha Lebra Mashata Yaba Baba 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 Lebra Zata Yaba Sanda La Brosa Libra Zuta Yaba Sanda La Brosa Tayaba La Brasata Yaba Baba 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 Lebra Zoto Yaba Sanda La Brosa Tayaba Glory 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Master. Thank you, everlasting God. Thank you, the Prince of Peace. Thank you, the Lord of Lord. Thank you, the Mighty God. Thank you, the Waymaker. Thank you, the Miracle Doer. Thank you, the Promise Keeper. Thank you, the Healer. 
Thank you, the deliverer. Thank you, the savior. Mashata ya bakala brasa hali brasa ha. Libra zuta ya basanda la brosha ta ya baba baba ma. Ma libra zata ya baka. Shout glory! Shout glory! The devil cannot stop you to see the manifestation of the glory of God. Shout glory! The Bible says, For this reason, he came here on earth for the glory of God to manifest. Shout glory! If the light is rising upon your life, uh, I want you to shout glory! Glory! Is anyone among us rising? Uh, if you are rising and you are shining, uh, shout glory! Shout glory! Shout glory! of God. Take your seat. Hallelujah. Arise and shine for the glory of the Lord is risen upon thee. Amen. The glory is the manifestation of God himself. So be expectant this year that God will manifest in your life in a bigger way in Jesus name. Amen. Happy New Year everyone. Happy New Year. Amen. On behalf of my father in the Lord and my mother, Lady Amy Peterside, I would, like, I would like to welcome you here present in this place and uh, viewers all around the world, those that are following us through Facebook, YouTube, ATV, or the app, I welcome you to the Miracle Center. I welcome you in the presence of God and I want to assure you that God will meet you today at the point of your need. Amen. Amen. Please, if you are worshiping with us for the first time, we would like you to stand on your feet. We want to welcome you. If you are here for the first time, we would like to welcome you. Hallelujah. Ambassadors, let's show love. You are somebody special. Welcome to CAC. You are somebody special. We hope you come again No matter who you are We say we love you No matter where you come from We've been praying for you You are somebody special We hope you come again Are so special to us we welcome you and we believe that you will join our family please fill up the information you are going to receive a call from us amen amen our announcement every sunday we meet here at 10 o'clock every sunday is our market day is the service of the miracles and wonders in god presence we meet here at 10 a.m in the morning and every Saturday, we meet at 8 a.m. in the morning for prayer. So they arise that next Saturday, we are going to meet here at 8 a.m. in the morning for the hour of power. Amen. Amen. And our uh, uh, service, our Wednesday service, is um, every Wednesday at 8. But uh, our Father in the Lord has said that we are going to resume the Wednesday service from next month which is the month of February from next month the Wednesday service will resume and all 
other services that we have or other meetings that we have, the main meeting, the youth and the women's meeting. And the Sunday school as well is going to resume next month, in, uh, next month which is February. Amen. Our new oil is out. The oil, uh, our anointing oil, the oil of glory uh, 2022 is out already, available at the, at the tag shop. Please, or at the table there, I see it at the back. Please uh, make sure that you get your own portal. Amen. 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 Offering time. Offering time. We are going to take our offering this morning, and we are going to read in the book of uh, Deuteronomy, chapter 15, verse 10. Deuteronomy, chapter 15, verse 10. That say, thou shalt surely give him, and thy, thy shall surely give him, and thy heart shall not be grieved. When thou givest unto him, because thou, for this thing, the Lord thy God shall bless thee in all thy works, and in all that puttest thine hands unto work. It just simply say that uh, we should give to God, we should surely give to God with all our hearts without grieving, and that uh, because God is the one who blesses all the works of our hand. Amen. This morning we are going to give to him because he's the one who makes it possible for us to have what he has given to us. As we are starting the new year, which is uh, January, let's start afresh with God. If we were not faithful in our giving, let's start being faithful in our giving. If we're not faithful in our tithe, let's start being faithful in our tithe. Then we'll see the glory of God manifesting in our finances. Amen. If we ask a question now, how would, would we want God to manifest in our life? Most of us will mention money. Most of us will mention the finances because we want to increase so that we can uh, live a, an ease life. So for you to have that kind of life, you need to give. You need to invest in the, in the kingdom of God. You need to put your treasure in God's um, kingdom, in God's store, where there is no moth that will eat it. Our Father in the Lord always says that when we put, when we give to God, it's like we are keeping it. The day we need it, we go and ask for it and it will give us. And when you give your tithe, you are just giving the 10% of your income, the 10% of what God is giving to you, so that the devil will not be able to touch the works of your hands. Hallelujah. So for this um, January, let's start with God. Let's give him what he deserves. The same as we prepare. We say, no, I'm, I'm saving, I'm keeping for Christmas or New Year. We should also have an habit of keeping for God. To start afresh. To give the first fruit. To give an offering, a huge offering. Every beginning of the year. And say to God, Father, this is I want. This is what I want. And you will see God doing it for you. Amen. Amen. Please, if you have your tithe, come to the front. If you have your tithe, please come to the front. Your tithe, as uh, he has commanded to us in the book of Malachi, chapter 3, from verse 10 down, if you read, he said that we should bring into the storehouse of God our tithe and, or, and our offering. And I love it when he says that, prove me and see if I will not open up the windows of heaven and pour the blessing. And he adds again and says, after putting the blessing, after pouring the blessing, he will also rebuke the devourer for our sake. Amen. Please lift up your tight. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray for your sons and your daughters who have obeyed to the principle, who have obeyed, almighty God, to your word by bringing the tithe into your house. Lord, I pray for increase on every side, increase in the works of their hand, O oh God. God of either Peter's side, God of miracle and wonders, I pray that you protect their offering, O oh God. Rebuke the devourer for their sake, O oh God. Increase them, O oh Father, Lord, and bless them abundantly in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Please let's stand on our feet with our offering. Please let's stand on our feet with our offering. You cannot come into the house of God empty-handed. As the Bible says, give it shall be given 
to you, good measure, praise down together, running over, shall men put in your bosom. Lift up your offering and begin to speak to him. Everyone, let's stand on our feet. Lift up your offering, begin to speak to him, begin to tell him that God, I have come to honor you, not only with the word of my mouth, not only with my dance of praise, but also with my substance. Receive it this morning. Oh, Father, we thank you, God, for allowing us, Almighty God, to worship you with our offering. We pray that you bless it and sanctify it, oh God. We pray, oh Father, Lord, oh God, that you multiply avenues, almighty God, uh, of income in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Let's give rejoicing. Come on, somebody put those hands together for Jesus. Come on, put those hands together. Glory of the Lord is coming down. Glory, glory, glory of the Lord is coming down. We say glory, glory, the glory.
Alléluia. Alléluia. We will continuously rejoice in him because we are more than conquerors. Amen. Please take your seat victoriously. Amen. Amen. We are so blessed in this house. We have a great father, amen, and a great mother in this house. And also, God has blessed us as well. Or has blessed our parents with great children or great sons and daughters. Amen. amen. And this morning, we are so privileged and honored because we'll be blessed by one of the sons of the house. Amen. 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 We are so blessed. I'm going to call uh, one of the Sons of Christ Ambassadors Church. He's a pastor in one of our branch, uh, Tembisa branch, Christ Ambassadors Church, Tembisa branch. Hallelujah. He's a great man of God. God is using him mightily in this time. I want to tell you one thing. When he comes here, open your hearts, your minds, and your ears. Because today you are going to receive. God is going to use him mightily today for that specific issue that you came with today. And I want to assure you that you will not go back the same way you came. The same anointing that is upon my father, Bishop Ida Peterside is the same anointing that is upon his son. So without wasting any time, I'm going to call Pastor Mekluli to come and bless us this morning. Please let's raise to our feet as we welcome the servant of God. Blessed be the Lord God Almighty who was and is and is to
I just want to take this opportunity to thank my father and my mother in the Lord to give me this time to minister to you on the first Sunday of the year. Hallelujah. You seem not to be happy on the first Sunday of the year. Pastor Comfort, we need to run here. Yeah. Amen. We need to show that we have entered. We need to show that what Satan had planned for us last year failed. Because we are here and we are still standing because of the grace of God. Hallelujah. We are going to run. We are going to dance. We are going to show the devil that he has failed. We are in 2022 in our year of my glory glorify him our glory this morning must glorify must glorify Jesus hallelujah we are going to come out and praise God and worship God the Bible says when the glory goes up when the praises goes up his glory comes down this morning the glory of God must come down I say the glory of God must come down. Hallelujah. Umu Chehov, Evule Minyango, Umu Chehov, Evule Minyango. Amen. Oh, my head. Sitsi Umu Chehov, Evule Minyango, Umu Chehov, Evule Minyango. Oh, 
Happy New Year. Because the New Year is showing its happiness. Don't yes. be like... Uh, we are not in a funeral. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Everybody stand. Everybody stand. We are going to pray. Hallelujah. We are going to pray. This is our first Sunday of the year. We need to pray. Father, let my glory give glory to you. Hallelujah. The Bible says, Arise and shine. For the glory of God has risen upon you. Let the glory of God that is bestowed in you begin to give glory to God. Father, let my glory, let the glory that is within me return glory to you. Open your mouth and begin to pray. My Father, my God, Mahande Brokosu Kabratea, Rihande Brokosu Kabrate, let my glory, Hayalalalabalaba, let my glory return glory to you. Let my glory show glory to you. Let my glory ayakala katamo. Rimahande prokosu kabladea. Rasake libo kosu kabate. Lihande ketela tela kataya. Rosuka bruto kosu kabladea. This year, oh God, in this year of 2022, let the glory that is bestowed in me begin to return glory to you. Ayakala prokosu kabladea. Mahande prokoto la basi kabladea. Mahande prokosu kabladea. Lahande. Rahale bokosu kabladea. Mahande bokosu kabladea. Ayale lele bosu kabladea. In Jesus mighty name. In Jesus mighty name. Amen. We are still praying. I want you to pray. Let the glory of God Let the cover glory you. Cover me. Let the glory of God cover me so that I can be invisible to the devil. Amen. Amen. This year, 2022, ah, yeah. Satan must not see you. That's right. The only thing that he can see is the glory of God. That's right. And he can do nothing about the glory of God. Amen. Let the glory of God cover me. Oh. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Oh, my, my Father, my God, my, my, let my the God. glory of of God. Let the glory of God cover me this 2022. Let me be invisible to the devil. Let me be invisible to the enemy. Let me be invisible to the tactics of the, of the enemy. In the mighty name of Jesus. Mahande Brokosu Kabrada, Rehande Lalabosi Kabrada, let the glory of God cover me, let the glory of God cover me, let the glory of God shine upon me. Ayakala Brokosu Kabradea, Mahande Brokoto Lavasekendea, Rasekele Boso Kondoyadea, Rahala Vasekende Kate, Rakate Katea, Mahande Brokotoya, Rasekele Katea, Ayakende Brokosu Kabrada, Mahande Brokosu Kabrada. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. We are still praying. Hallelujah. Amen. This is a great year. I said this is a great year. Amen. I said this is a great year. Amen. Hallelujah. It is the year of my glory. Everywhere I show up, let my glory show up before me. That's right. Hallelujah. Everywhere I show up, let my glory show up before me. When I'm going for an interview, let my glory show up before me that's right Amen. when i'm going anyway let my glory show up before me that's right let Amen. glory speak oh, for me Amen. open your mouth and begin to pray 
My father, my God. My father, my God. I am a Rima Calipro Cosu Cabrada. Core Fruma Sakele Kenneke. Rima Hande Procosu Cabrada. Rahande Bocosu Cabrada. Ayala Levosi Cabrada. Mahane Bocosu Cabrada. Sakanda Kataka Sakate. Rima Cabosu Cabrada. Ayala Levosi Cabrada. Sakanda Kataka. Ayala Bosi Cabrada. Sakanda Bocotoya. Ayala Bata. Rima Kate, Rasake Procosu Cabrada, Rima Kate Katea, Rima Corsu Cabrada, Rasake Kate Kate, Mahande Procosu Cabrada, Mahande Kele Katea, Rima Kate Bocosu Cabrada, Masake Kele Bocotoya, Rahande Kate Kate, Mahande Procosu Cabrada, Aya Lavasi Cabrada, Mahande Kate Kate, Rakande Kate. Rakanda Katea, Rakanda Katea, Rakanda Katea, Aya Bosu Cabrada, in Jesus' mighty name, Amen. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen. We are setting a standard. Hallelujah. That's right. It's our first Sunday of the year. Whatever you pray this morning here, it will take you to the 31st of December. Yes. If you pray amiss, if you pray amiss, the whole year will be a missed call. That's correct, sir. If you pray amiss now, the whole year will be a missed call. You try this, no way. You do this, no way. You must set your standard now. That's right. Hallelujah. Amen. You must set it now. Let the devil know that you did not enter this 2022 by chance. That's right. Let him know that you entered and you are there. You are there to stay. You will not die this year. I say you will not die this year. Amen. Your blessings will come to you this year. Hallelujah. Everything heaven has mandated for you, it must come this year. Amen. That's right. It must come. Whether the devil likes it or not, we'll push him and push him and push him and tell him, get away behind us. Yes. It's time for us to manifest. Amen. It's time for us to show. Amen. It's time for us to show the glory of God. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. This morning I'm preaching on the subject the sacrifices for glory. You think glory comes cheaply? Glory comes with sacrifice. The sacrifices for glory. God is the manifestation of God's presence and is perceived by men. God is the character of God. It is the tsunami that contains the character of God, the spiritual tsunami. When glory shows up, sickness leaves. Oh, you don't hear what I'm saying. If glory appears, disease, affliction, go. They cannot be in the same camp with the glory of God. He told Moses, he said, when you come to the mountain, make sure there is no one close. He said, neither the heads, the cows must not come close. Glory of God cannot be contaminated. I say it again. The glory of God cannot be contaminated. Hallelujah. This year, you can't mix glory and other things. I say you can't mix glory and other things. You must shine. And when you shine, darkness goes. Darkness. 
darkness cannot comprehend light. Unless if you have got a small, even if it's small, even if it's a small light, darkness is threatened. Oh, you don't hear what I'm saying. Even if the light is very small, very small, darkness cannot stand. In that small vicinity, in that small catchment area, darkness disappears. Your light must shine this year. I say your glory must shine this year. Sickness, affliction must be history. Therefore, 2021, this year 2022, we are working in good health. 1 Corinthians chapter 2. You may be seated in the presence of God. 1 Corinthians chapter 2. Verse 7. Listen carefully. First Corinthians chapter 2 verse 7. But we impart a secret and a hidden wisdom of God. This is Paul speaking. He said, I, Paul. This is King James. He said, I, Paul. I impart the secrets and the hidden wisdom of God. And he said it was decreed before ages by God himself for the glory of our glory. He said I come here as an instrument, as a custodian of the secret and hidden wisdom of God. There is a wisdom that is hidden, that was not revealed to ages, but he say, I came to impart it. When I impart this wisdom of God that was hidden for ages, your glory will manifest. Yeah. Oh, you don't hear what I'm saying. He said, there is something that is hidden. And this thing that is hidden is the wisdom of God. It's a secret. It was decreed in ages. And those people of ages did not know. It was not revealed to them. But he said, I, Paul, it has been revealed to me. Therefore, I come and impart it to you so that the glory of God will manifest in you. There is glory that has been bestowed in storehouses for years. But this 2021, I come under the mandate and under the unction of my Father in the Lord, under the mandate of heaven, on a priesthood garment, I decree and I declare the same wisdom of God that will bring glory to you, into you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. The wisdom of God is the one that bringeth glory to you. The mind of God, the intellect of God, It is the one that reveals who you are. As long as you don't know who you are, you don't know your glory. Until you identify yourself. Mm. Some people walk, women of God, some people just walk so long life. It is not so long life. You must identify who you are. Once the moment to identify who you are, you identify the mind of God in you. The moment you identify the mind of God in you, that is the wisdom of God, then your glory begins to show. 
I am talking to somebody this morning. I don't know whom I'm talking to, but I have come under the mandate of my Father in the Lord to declare the wisdom of God into your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. It is the mind of God that will begin to show your glory. The sacrifice for glory. Glory does not come just cheap. You don't just pray, pray, pray. You waste, you, you, you waste your words. You hear what I'm saying? Prayer is good. I say prayer is good. But if you pray the wrong way, you will spend 10,000 words for nothing. You, you, you even lose your vocal cord for nothing. Hallelujah. I told, I told people in Tempest, I said I changed the style of prayer. I used to pray, women of God, come here, intercession. Like, I, I prayed like lunatic, nothing to show. Nothing to show. One day, Dr. Kalonji came. It was on a Tuesday. We pray. No voice. Every Sunday. Hey, 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 hey. But nothing. Check in my pocket, in my bank account. Zero. Nothing to show. You do this, nothing to show. He came on a Tuesday. On our prayer meeting. He gave me an injection. For my voice. You must pray correct, oh. Oh, you don't hear me. You must pray correct, oh. I was praying, praying, praying. Day and night. No time even for my wife. Prayer. Prayer. Nothing. Now I've got a psychedelic way of prayer. I know God is a gentleman. When I sit with him, I sit with him. You hear what I'm saying? You sit with God. Don't, don't make noise to God. Imagine, you go to your boss. You tell your boss, I want money. I want money. I want, you're making noise. Sit down with your boss. Talk. Now I know how to talk. Oh. Hallelujah. I say I know how to talk. The day he gave me injection, I couldn't lift my hand. I tried this. No way. Because it was my zeal to lift my hand. I was lifting them like this. I don't make that nonsense anymore. I know how to pray. Paul said, I came to give you the wisdom of God. To impart to you. So that your glory will begin to manifest. The sacrifice of glory. Second Chronicles chapter 7. The sacrifices of glory. Please put it up. Second Chronicles chapter 7. Verse 1. Second Chronicles chapter 7. Now when Solomon had made an end of praying. Now when Solomon had made an end of praying. Comma. The fire came down from heaven. Comma. And consumed the burnt offering. And the sacrifice. Stay there. Keep it there. Now when Solomon had made an end of prayer, there is a beginning of prayer and there is an end of prayer. Hallelujah. There is where you start praying. When you start praying, you have things that you want to pray for. But the truth about it, the Bible said, when he had ended praying, Fire came down from heaven. Fire is not glory. Oh, you miss me. Fire is not glory. Fire came for something. And glory came for something. 
He said, when he had finished the praying, fire was dispersed in heaven. Hallelujah. Fire was dispersed for something, which is the sacrifice. Fire cannot be released in heaven without a sacrifice. So in other words, Solomon, before he started praying, there is something that he prepared. He prepared a sacrifice in the altar. And said, when I'm done praying, I will wait. A lot of people come before God and pray and pray and pray from January to December. But there is nothing that God the fire of God must come and take. You, you think that the man of God is a liar. No. He heard from God. There is a sacrifice that you must put on the altar so that the fire of God will come and consume the sacrifice. People waste time and pray when there is nothing, when there is no sacrifice on the altar. He said when he was done praying, he first prepared the sacrifice. Then he went before God and said, God, this year I want a house. This year I want a husband. This year I want healing. This year I want this. This year I want this. This year I want this. After that he waited. Waited for the fire. The Bible says, and the fire came down. Oh, something must follow the fire. Put it up. Something must follow the fire. It's a protocol. Woman of God, it's a protocol. It, it does not just happen. You must put a sacrifice. The moment you put a sacrifice, it's a protocol. It goes by sequence by sequence. When you put a sacrifice, then you can pray. Then fire will come. And you say, And the glory of the Lord filled the house. Some versions say, and the glory of the Lord filled the temple. This is the temple of the living God. For glory to be, stored, to be bestowed here, you must put a sacrifice. After a sacrifice, after a sacrifice, the fire will come in this body. When the fire consumes this body, the glory of God begins to manifest. Hear me. Hear me. As long as you are still living, as long as you are still yourself, as long as this body is still yours, nothing will happen. Oh, you don't hear what I'm saying. Romans chapter 12. Romans chapter 12, verse 1. Put it up. As long as this body is still yours, nothing will show. Neither the glory of God will never show. Romans chapter 12, verse 1. If this body, brother Jack, belongs to you, forget it. I beseech you, therefore. He said, I beg you. I'm not commanding you. He said, I beg you. I appeal to you, brethren, by the mercies of God, not by my own accord. He said, by the mercies of God, that you present, ah, oh, that this body of yours must die. Present your bodies as a living sacrifice, wholly acceptable unto God, which is your reasonable worship. Which is your reasonable worship. Which is your reasonable service. Until your body decays, nothing will come out of it. For a seed to be glorious, it must go down. The seed must die. When it dies, after a few days, it will germinate. When it germinates, it is showing its glory. I came under the unction of my Father in the Lord. I declare and I decree unto you, 
This year you will show your glory in the name of Jesus. Your body must be a living sacrifice. Your body must die. Your body must not belong to you. The moment you consider your body, you are finished. I say it again. If you consider who you are, that I am so and so, I'm, 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 I am, I am, I like this woman. You see this woman? I respect her very much. Put camera there. Today I'm in charge. Hallelujah. Put camera there. She's a great woman. No? Hallelujah. Some of you, you see a dance here, you don't know who she is. She, she is sold out. Oh, you don't hear. I mean, it's got HIV. I don't care. But this year, she's a great woman. She is sold out. When you see her dance here, you will wonder, who is this one? Even you yourself, you will say, she's wasting her time. She's not all. She has sold her body as a living sacrifice. Holy presentable before heaven. The moment you present your body, the Bible says, which is your reasonable worship. The moment your body becomes a reasonable worship, he said, I dwell. Ah, the Shekinah. The Shekinah, which is the, the dwelling glory of God. Become and stay in your reasonable worship. Oh, you don't hear what I'm saying. The Shekinah, which is the dwelling glory of God. This why I dwell in the midst of those who give a reasonable worship. Because their bodies are sold out. Hallelujah. Minister Comfort, until your songs change from being songs, he said to Hosea, chapter 14, verse 2, he said, until your songs, until your praise change from being songs to become calves in your lips, then he shows up. Then the glory of God shows up. The presence of God shows up. Wherever you show up, ah, la tell, la tell, la tell, la tell, la tell. Rima kadimo kosuka, brother. When you show up, the presence of God shows up with you. The character of God shows up with you. It, it, it becomes evident that there is someone living in you. Paul says, bother me not, trouble me not, for I carry this cars. I carry the marks in, in my body. I have died. Even if you gossip me, you are wasting your time. Even if you stone me, you are wasting your time. He said, they stoned me. I have evidence. They persecuted me. I have evidence. They locked me in prison. I have evidence. I have a re track record. He said, trouble me, don't bother me, you're wasting your time. If you gossip me, you're wasting your time. Where I come from, there is evidence in my body. Galatians 17 verse 6. He said, there is evidence in my body. There is something in my body that shows that I'm dead. There is nothing you can do to a dead man. Even if you kick, that dead man does not feel anything. Hallelujah. There is nothing you can do to someone who is sold out. I declare and I decree. Under the unction of my father in the Lord, Bishop Dr. Ida Peter side, and under a garment of priesthood, this morning, that this 2022, this 2022, I say this 2022, I'm speaking to the few individuals here. I say this 2022, 
when they see you they will only see the glory of God in the name of Jesus South Africa will see the glory of God in you in the name of Jesus they will not comprehend you in the name of Jesus hallelujah the Bible says, and Jesus was praying In the field of Gethsemane. And Hemahidras showed up. The people that were close to him saw. Because this was witnessed by him. They say his, his sweats were dropping like the sweats of blood. They saw. But they were there. <laughs> they saw. But they were there. Why were then sweats not dropping? The same way Jesus' sweats dropped. They were there the whole night with him. They turned around, they saw Elijah. They saw Moses. They came to Jesus and said, Can we build three temples? They omit themselves. They said, Can we build three temples? One for Jesus. One for Elijah, one for Moses. But they are there. Peter is there. James is there. John is there. Why are they not saying our temple? There is something with the body of Jesus Christ. The glory showed up. This 2022, as we prayed, I said, If you don't do, make a foundation now, the whole 2022 will be a missed call. Some will walk in the glory of God. Some will not. Not that you are not coming to church. But you are coming to church. The difference is what are you doing when you come to church? And the difference is are you sold out? Is your body a living sacrifice? Jesus sold out his body and said, do whatsoever you want to do. If you crucify me, crucify me. If you spit on me, spit on me. If you whip me, whip me. Become like a tissue paper. Hallelujah. For the glory of God to show on you. Something must happen for you this year. I say something must happen for you this year. For that thing to happen, you must crucify yourself. A plant germinates and begin to show its glory. Begin to show its glory. You will see it shining. In the early mornings, you will see a plant shining. Shining, 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 shining. Few months later, you will see it yields fruits it yields fruits your glory must yield fruits that your amen has got a biggest 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 HIV I said your glory must yield fruits this year Hallelujah. You must testify. You must come back with the testimony that this year was a different year. Hallelujah. We cannot be in running in circles, moving in circles, doing the same thing. Things are changing. I say things are changing. If you remain in the same place, 
where you were last year. You are on your own, no? Hallelujah. The glory has risen upon us to manifest God's glory in us. You cannot be in the same place this year. The glory of God must take you from glory to glory. There is a collision of your glory and the glory of God. The moment the collision of your, of your glory and the glory of God, it moves you from glory to another glory to another glory. Paul says, the veil has been removed in your eyes. In your faces so that you reflect God the veil has been removed in your face so that you reflect God wherever you show up you show up with the tsunami of God you show up with the glory of God when they see you they see they don't see you. They see God in you. Paul says, I'm no longer me that lives. But Christ lives in me. If you see me, you don't see Paul. You see Christ in me. Everything I do, I don't eat my own. No. The food I eat, I'm the Holy Ghost tells me what to eat, what to dress, where to sleep, what to do. The moment you see, you just eat chunk, 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 anyhow. You wake up in the midnight, 12 o'clock. You eat watermelon. Your body has not been sold out. Hallelujah. The Holy Ghost takes over your body. Everything you do, when they received him, he began to tell them, go to Antioch, go to Jerusalem, go to this, go to Corinth, go to Ephesus. When he lives in you, when you are sold out, when you are crucified, the glory of God will manifest in you. Stand to your feet. When you are sold out, when you are crucified, when it's no longer you living, but Christ lives in you, The glory of God begins to manifest. This year, I say this year, as we have begun the year, the glory of God will manifest at its highest level in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. The glory of God will take you blessings in the name of Jesus. Amen. The glory of God will ascend you in the name of Jesus. Amen. The glory of God will release blessings that are to you this year in the name of Jesus. Amen. The glory of God who close graves that were meant for you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I declare and I decree under the action of my father in the Lord, Bishop Dr. Ida Peterson, that the glory of God that is bestowed in you will hide you from danger in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. 
your body, your life, your prayer, your fellowship with God will return glory to God in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Help me.
the glory of God is about to fall in this place like never before. I want you to open your, your spirit, open your heart. Allow the presence of God, allow the tsunami of God, allow the character of God to be bestowed in you. As we sing this song, please open your spirit, open your heart. Just allow him to flow. Be the temple that he comes and dwell in him. Be the temple that he shows up and dwell in it. Offer your body a living sacrifice. Offer your mind a living sacrifice. Offer your spirit a living sacrifice. Offer yourself a living sacrifice. Let the glory of God, I am a boss, Cabradea, leave a hand of Procoto Lava, Cabrada. Glory, Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Glory.
Ayala Baraba de Kerebo si Cabrara Mahare Rebo Kosi Cabrara. Just open your mouth and begin to pray in the spirit. Rima Karebo Kosi Cabrada Lahare Kebo Kotoraba se Kebra da la Barabataya. Riala Barabara Barabarebo Koso Korea Barabatoya. Masekende pro kosto talabate Ripa kate kerebo si kabradea Makande pro koto la kate kate katea Rekebo kosu kabra kate kate Ria la karebo kosi kabradea Mahande bo kosu kabrate kalebo kosi kabrada Ma karebo koto la basi kabrada. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Glory, glory, oh glory, oh glory. Hallelujah, glory, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Glory, hallelujah. hallelujah. Lift your hands. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Glory, hallelujah. Lift your hands. Hallelujah. Lift your hands. Hallelujah. hallelujah. manifest the glory of God must manifest in your life the glory of God must show in your life there is someone here your knees your knees I don't know what's wrong with your knees your knees your knees your knees you hardly stand because your knees I don't know whom I'm talking to you hardly stand because of your knees where are you you hardly stand because your knees give you give you problems your knees your knees the glory of God is here Hallelujah. Glory. 
glory to God. man what's wrong with having too much money it's enough it's enough it's enough, it's enough. who are you are you holding a finances who are you fire all over you From your head to your toe, fire! It's, it's our year of our glory. Yeah, yeah. Uh -uh. Glory, yeah. It's too much. You glory in finances. <laughs> Hallelujah. You glory in finances. If you don't have money, how do you, how do you make your hair style? Give them small. Give them small. Not too much. Who are you? Fire! Release their finances. She must close. Release! Come on, release! Release! It's too much. What is too much? What is it that is too much? She can't. She can't. She can't be a millionaire. She can't be a millionaire. We are no longer talking of millionaires. We are moving from glory to glory. What is million? your glory collides with the glory of God, it must be evidential. Amen. Come on, loser, let it go. Loser, let it go. In the mighty name of Jesus. I can't hear you. I'm releasing everything. You are releasing it. Yes, glory. Release, glory. release a glory. Yes. Yes. Release a glory. Everything. Come on, loser, let it go. At the count of three. One, two, three, go! In Jesus' name. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God. There is another one here. You have a problem with your, your, your right shoulder. Your right shoulder. I don't know what is the problem with your right shoulder. Your right shoulder. Please, if it's the right shoulder, stand this side. The right shoulder. You hardly lift with your right hand. Ah, 
the glory of God the glory of God you are the lamb upon the throne lift your hands lift your hands please lift your hands lift your hands I shall stand behind you lift your hands lift your hands I lift my voice in praise the Bible says the mention of his name every knee will bow Every tongue will confess that Jesus is Lord. Every affliction, every problem, they bow at the mention of the name of Jesus Christ. Now I command your knees. I command your knees. Any pain in your knees, any affliction in your knees, any disease in your knees, any sickness in your knees now I command the glory of God I command the glory of God to touch those knees the glory of God touch the knees now in the mighty name of Jesus be healed now be healed now in Jesus mighty name and go. Lose it. Let it go. Now. 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 Lose it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. You can't hold it anymore. She doesn't belong to you. She belongs to Jesus. The glory of God must manifest in her this year 2022. Release it. Let it go. Let it go. I said let it go. Let it go. Now, in Jesus' name. Let it go. You can't hide. I say you can't hide. Go. Now. Now. Lose it. Let it go. Let it go. Release it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. The mighty name of Jesus. Let it go. You can't hold it anymore. In Jesus' name. What have you done to him? What have you done to him? Come and speak. What have you done to him? What have you done? Look at me. Release it. Release it. Let it go. Release it. Let it go. Let it go. 
Who are you? Fire! Fire! From your head to your toe. Lucy, let her go. Let her go! Fire! Who knows this, lady, this girl? Please come. It's my sister's daughter. Your sister's daughter? What yes. does she do? She has a problem with her. She's saying she has a problem with her knees. What else does she do? Like what, Pastor? Anything that she does. She's a nice child, I say. I think so. Where is the city? She's is at the home mother? in Eastern Cape. The mother is in Eastern Cape? Yes. She came for holidays. She's still young? She's 15. I will talk to you later. Yes, She's still young. I can't talk. There are some things that you protect the child. Lose it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Now. 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 Lose it. Let it go. Come on, loser, let her go. 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 The mighty name of Jesus. Let her go. She doesn't belong to you. Release her legs now. Release. The mighty name of Jesus. Lose it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Now. This is the reason why he was made manifest. So you can take our afflictions. In Jesus' name. Free. Jesus' name. Right shoulder. Please hold your right shoulder with your left. Hold your right shoulder with your left. Father, I pray for them. I command healing. I command healing. I command healing in the right shoulder. Touch them. Touch them, I pray. Touch them, O oh God. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. You are healed. Yes. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory, hallelujah. Did I say sit down? <laughs> Your time. Glory. Glory. If you sit down, you disconnect. Glory. Hallelujah.
to pray and say Father this 2022 I will shine Hallelujah if you don't speak it to yourself it will not manifest you have to speak it don't speak it only today. Every day you wake up, say, I will shine. Yes. I will shine. I will shine. For the glory of God has risen upon me. Yes. So open your mouth and say, Father, this year, 2022, the whole 366 days I will shine. Amen. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Father, my Father, my God, this year 2022, all the days of 2022, I will shine. I will shine. My life will shine. My endeavors will shine. Everything will shine. Whatever I touch will shine. Everywhere I go, I will shine. Oh, I can't pray for Sukha, brother. I will shine this year. I will shine this year. I will shine this year. I will manifest this year. I will shine this year. I can't propose to come I can't propose to come I will shine. I will shine. Every day of my life, I will shine. Everywhere I go, I will shine. Everything, everything I do, who shine? I am Katibra for Sukabrana. Mahanda Telebo for Tolama Sukabrana. Mahanda Telebo Rima Kalibra for Sukabrana. I will shine this year. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. If you are here this morning, you have not known Jesus. Or you know. 2021. You did not do well. In the presence of God. You want to rectify your life. You see this glory we are talking about. Will never, never, never manifest. If you don't make peace with God. Amen. It will never, never show if you don't make peace with God. You are here this morning. You say, Pastor, I want to start afresh. This is our first Sunday of the year. You say, I want to start afresh. I want to begin in a fresh page. Hallelujah. We don't care over things for 2021. In the kingdom we begin a new season. Hallelujah. Are you following what I'm saying? In the kingdom, we begin a new season. A new era. You are here this morning. You say, I want to make it right. I want to make peace with God. Please come. Please come. Please come. Don't, don't care about other people. It's your own. This thing is about yourself. This thing is not about 
about my friend. No, your friend won't be there. Your pocket. Your friend cannot fill your pocket, but the glory of God will fill your pocket. Your family members that you are scared of, they will not make you shy. But the glory of God is the one that will make you shy. Make peace with God. Start a new page. Start afresh. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. Start a new page. A new chapter. God is waiting for such that say, I'm sorry. I want to begin a better journey with you. This 22, 20, a lot happened in 2021. A lot. A lot. And you are here. God is giving you this opportunity. Opportunities come once. Women of God, they come once. They don't come the second time. Come and make peace with God. I give you one minute. Come and make peace with God. I, 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 I read the story. This woman went to church with the two, two children. Soon after church, they were involved in an accident. And all of them died. They went to church like today. After the service, gone. People who only remember you only one week. They will be saying, ah, he's dead, he's dead. Only for one week. After the second week, they forget about you. But the truth about it, where are you? After two weeks. Are you in the bosom of God? Or you are in another part? Because if you miss heaven, you can't miss hell. No? If you miss heaven, you can't miss hell. It's either you miss hell and make heaven. Hallelujah. Come and make peace with God. Heavens rejoice. Trust me, your name will be written in the Lamb's Book of Life. Just now. You will be recorded in the Lamb's Book of Life. Even if anything happens, you are numbered there. A criminal, a criminal, a man that was taken from prison, a criminal, a man that was released from prison, was crucified with Jesus. No baptism. No impartation of the Holy Ghost. He said to Jesus, remember me. He was a thief. A thief. For a thief to be crucified, it must be a problem. He was the, the highest thief. He only said, remember me when you get there. Automatical. It was automatical. Jesus said, today, I will be with you in paradise. He said, today I will be with you in paradise. No baptism, no Holy Ghost, no, no prayer line, nothing. In a point of death, your names will be written in the books, in the Lamb's Book of Life. Now, just now, for the decision you have made, no controversy. Say, Lord Jesus. Say it loud so that the devil will hear. Say, Lord Jesus. Come into my heart. From today. 
you become the Lord and my personal Savior. I receive you. And I make an announcement to the devil. I can't hear. I only hear these people that refuse to come. I hear these people that refuse to come. I, I can't hear you. Say, I make an announcement to the devil. That I don't belong to you. I belong to Jesus. Father, thank you for saving me. In Jesus' name. You are saved. Let me pray for you. Father, they have accepted you. They have received you. Forgive them their sins. Cleanse them with your blood. Make them new creatures. Let them be announced in this world that they belong to you. Their bodies belong to you. Let the glory of God shine upon them from today in Jesus' name. God bless you. Congratulations. Follow, 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 follow that man. Follow that man. Hallelujah. I always wonder. I always wonder when they call altar call. Do you hear people confessing their sins? Behind the sins. How do you confess your sins behind the sins? I hear people, Father, forgive me my sins. They are that side. <laughs> They refuse to show up. The Bible says, if you are ashamed of me in the sight of men, he said, I'll be ashamed of you in the sight of my father. Simple arithmetics. Simple. You can do, do well, do well, come to church, everything. But if you are ashamed of Jesus here in the sight of us, uh -huh, he will be ashamed of you in the sight of of the Father. Prayer line. There's prayer line. Woman of God, come help me. Prayer line. Those that are in the prayer line, please come. They are outside. Doing what outside? We are, we are sweating here. People are outside. Prayer line, come. Men of God, come. Come. Let's pray for them. For you and Lord. All the pastors, please come. And worthy. How many are they? Only one. You are the last upon the other one is outside.
opens this month they will reinstate you Amen. it is not by your own accord but the glory of God that is in you will propel them to reinstate you Amen. stand to your feet let me cross. Lift your hands. Father, I stand on this altar. The holy altar. Under the unction of my father in the Lord. Under the authority of priesthood. And under the mandate of heaven. I declare and I decree. I declare and I decree. That from today. The glory of God. Will shine on you in the name of Jesus. I say the glory of God will shine on you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I declare and I decree that the wisdom that has been hidden ages will begin to shine on you in the name of Jesus. Amen. I say the wisdom of God that the people of age, the prophets, was not revealed to them, will be revealed to you in the name of Jesus. Every day of your life, from today, will be glorious in Jesus' name. I say will be glorious in Jesus' name. Every grave that is open to swallow you. The one that touched the grave will fall into it in the name of Jesus. I say the glory of God will push the one that touched the grave 
into that grave in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, thank you. Thank you for the testimonies of glory that will follow in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you for the testimonies Amen. that will come this year in 2022 in the name of Jesus. Amen. No one is permitted to die. But everyone in this house, every ambassador, everyone on the television, everyone who is listening on Facebook is not permitted to die. But they are permitted to see the glory of God manifesting in their life in this 2022 in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, thank you. Thank you for it shall not be otherwise. In Jesus' mighty name. God bless you. Happy New Year. Happy Glorious Year. Happy Glorious 2022. In the name of Jesus. May God bless you. May he make his light to shine upon you. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Please, all head of departments, let me meet here in front. Every head of department here present, please come to the front. Choir, ushering, security, intercessor. Every department, Sunday school, royal guards. If they are not here, if there is any representative, Please come to the front. Choir, ushering, iron men, women, battle eggs. If there is any representative, please come to the front. Every head of departments. Departmental aid, please. Sanitation, if there is any. Every department, you know yourselves. Please come and sit next to uh, Brother Fortune here. 